Yes, we have the stars in studio. JP Cooper with us on your Feel Good Breakfast show. I know earlier Graham mentioned that we're missing the dreadlocks, and I feel like this is a question you're probably getting a lot right now. Yeah. What was the decision for you to, to cut the dreads? Do you know, I had them for 20 years. Sure. So I think it just got to a point where I, I felt like it's time for a change. Um, there's a lot of reasons, but it just felt like the right time. Okay. And I feel lighter, I feel... I mean, how heavy were they? They weren't too bad, but, you know, life just <laughs> seems easier with them. And, you know, I can sort of blend in a little more, which is nice. So. Well, I think it was Coco Chanel that said, um, well, this is true to you, but a person that's about to change their hair is about to change their life. And that's pretty cool because my pending nuptials are happening pretty soon. And I know you've recently just celebrated your fourth wedding anniversary. Yeah. The wedding day goes by so quickly and then mm. boom, it's been four years later yeah. for you. If you could go back to that day and just pick a highlight, what would you say was that for you and your wife? It was, I think the moment after the ceremony, the moment where we walked into, you know, we had this big marquee, we did like an outdoor thing and all of our family, all of our loved ones, and just seeing the smiling faces of so many people genuinely, genuinely happy for us. And that'll stay in my, in my mind forever. That was beautiful. That was um, definitely the, the, the snapshot of that day. Oh, that is yeah. incredible. Well, we wish you many, many happy years, and Thank congratulations you. on your fourth wedding anniversary. Yeah. Now, when it comes to picking songs for any set or any concert, or even coming here to the show, it's always a tough one. How did you pick the next song you, you're about to perform? <sighs> I'll level with you. It's early, we did a big show last night, so I thought, what songs can I sing that aren't going to, that hopefully <laughs> my voice isn't gonna be completely tired on? So I'm like, let me try a few where I can kind of express it in a way that I'm not having to be all raucous. <laughs> but also, no, I think coming here, I feel like the connection with, with the audience down here they seem like they're responding to the really heartfelt, soulful moment. So I thought, let me come. It's a morning. Let's do something intimate. Um, so we'll see how we go. Fantastic. Well, you're about to perform for us. This one is Beneath, Beneath the Streetlights street lights and, and the Moon. Yeah. Oh, well, we are very excited. <laughs> I'm very honoured that you are here today. Pleasure. So, ladies and gentlemen, on your Feel Good Breakfast show, J.P. Cooper. Thank you. Let me talk about the things I miss for a minute. Lend a knee, I want you come and see for a while. I miss his riding home at 4 a.m. Do you remember? Birds applaud as we turn into your street. Of all the things I miss, I miss the view. I miss the way you look beneath the street lights and the moon. And of all the things I miss, the taste of you, the taste of you on me and me. I wonder if my finest days are behind me. We were living in a golden haze, so free. I miss us dancing in the midnight rain. Do you remember upstage in springtime in your daisy chain? Of all the things I miss, I miss of you. I miss the way you look beneath the street lights and the moon. And of all the things I miss, the taste of you, the taste of you on me and me on you. I'm for 
forever inspire Like time was a canvas we painted Looking back, I see colors And those colors ain't fading Still we're growing, we're changing And still sometimes I need saving But looking back, I see colors And of all the things I miss Looking back, I see color.